Napoleon, you keep talking about be me being a liar, but you do not have worthy examples. Those hoof prints could be yours, Squealer's, or any other pig on the farm. I am not the only explana explanation. I have a couple reasons why you or Squealer would do it. One, you would want to make the other animals work harder and stay away from the farmhouse or barn so they wouldn't catch you and the other pigs drinking alcohol or changing the commandment and the rules. That's right, we all know about the rules and commandments being changed. It's very obvious, Napoleon. It is in a pig's handwriting. How do I know? Because you and Squealer are the only ones on the farm who can write. Me? Selfish? You stole the windmill idea from me. I will fight to make this right until I die. I will not stand for this, Napoleon. I will not. Whenever something good happens, I claim it when it is my idea. If you have a good idea, you should claim it. Whenever something bad happens, all signs point to you, Napoleon. You ask for an example. Just look at how horrible the conditions have been for the past years. Napoleon, I was there. I did write the commandments, so I very well know that you have changed them. There have been, th been things added and things removed. Commandment 4 stated, no animal shall ever sleep in a bed. But now it states, no animal shall ever, ever sleep in a bed with sheets. So you see, you have changed them so you don't look like a liar. But Napoleon, everyone knows that you are a liar. So, Napoleon, to conclude these statements, I say, you are a liar, a cheater, and a very selfish pig. Goodbye.